We are getting ready to have a great time today. This is our family fun day, also health fair. We are encouraging wellness today and having a great time. We're incorporating the two things that we need most. Shouts out to our Memorial Healthcare Centers. They are on site to the world famous Miami Dolphins. They're here as well today on a beautiful sunny Saturday. Hello, Miramar. I'm Commissioner Wayne Messam, and I'm at the Miramar Health Fair and Family Fun Day. This event was sponsored by Memorial Hospital Miramar, Joe DiMaggio Children's Hospital, and Santa Fe Pharmaceuticals. They are providing some excellent healthcare information, not just for acute care, but pre for preventative care, whether you have heart disease, diabetes, uh, mental disease, uh, muscular disease, all of these diseases are being educated and information is being provided. We actually do blood pressure screen, okay? We also have a cholesterol table, we have a woman's uh, table. Um, I mean, we're here for the community. Numbers a little bit high. I don't know why every time I come to a place like this, my pressure comes high. Goes up? Okay. <laughs> well, just keep an eye on it, okay? Yeah, all right. There's a, quite a few people that have come through the table that uh, are not aware that they have a little bit of a high uh, blood pressure. So it's kind of we kind of recommend them to follow up with their primary physician if they have one. Very nice. They do this, you know, because uh, this is good for uh, you. You could check that you have. Prevention is a major, major portion of where Miramar Fire Rescue is headed in the future. Obviously, responding to 911 calls is still a very strong uh, mission for us. But if we can prevent some of the things that that are that are happening out there that can be prevented, such as drownings and accidents involving bicycles, then we're gonna take a major, major part in reaching out to our community to teach and educate. Uh, and this is a perfect forum for us to do that. We have smoke detectors that we're doing demos on and plenty of brochures on keeping kids and the elderly uh, safe. So we're very grateful to be here. It's extremely important that we have smoke detectors at home, that we have them inside every bedroom and one in every common area. Smoke alarms are essential for waking someone up if there was a fire where most fires happen, which is while we're sleeping. That's the only purpose for this thing, is to wake us up or alert us if we're not near where that fire is happening. Smoke alarms, as I mentioned earlier, should be in every bedroom. What we don't want seeing is people just disconnecting these. When they start beeping in the middle of the night, you want to go out the next day and buy those nine volt batteries. We're also letting everyone know that they have new smoke alarms that don't require a battery change. Uh, they sell them at the local hardware stores now and they're good for 10 years. So once you put them in, you don't have to worry about replacing those batteries for a long time. And uh, more people die in the US due to fires than every other natural disaster combined. And this is one simple step we can take to keep a lot of us safe. With type one, the person makes no insulin. The body attacks the cells in the pancreas that make insulin and the person is insulin dependent. With type two, Type 2 used to be called adult onset diabetes. With type 2 diabetes, the person does make insulin. However, their insulin is not working the way it should. We are the best institute in the world in alternative and holistic medicine. People that come to Hippocrates to get healed, different diseases, cancer, um, or just people that want to get detox or just improve their health. I am a medical doctor. and. Almost seven years ago, I had cancer. Um, after that, after my healing and everything, I changed the way that I see my career. And now I work in Hippocrates. My main goal is to bring this to the Spanish community all over the world, to bring this philosophy and another way to see health, um, optimum health. My principal function is to bring this to the Hispanic community informar a los hispanos que hay otra manera de ver la salud, que hay que cambiar la manera en que nos alimentamos. Personalmente, hace siete años tuve cáncer en la cuerda vocal izquierda. Estudié nutrición integral, cáncer y nutrición. E hice el programa de educación en salud en el instituto y ahora trabajo ahí. 
We also have a fun kid zone with the Miami Dolphins, Joe DiMaggio. We have face painting, rock climbing. I'm very happy to be here today in our health fair. We have a lot of attractions. We have the DJ, we have bounce house, rock wall. We have here the face painter. We have a character over there. We have a lot of fun. I think to do these kind of uh, events, you need to like kids. Our company is uh, Universal Fun. Uh, we have we do all kinds of events since uh, corporate events. We have a catering division. Hey! <laughs> okay. This is kind of difficult. I already tried it on this side, but I'm gonna try it this time, and I'm determined to go up. <laughs> Well, thank you, Miramar, for putting the event together. We really appreciate it. I think it's great that the um, city puts out events like this, so awareness for the community. It's always good. The reason for this event is to promote wellness and physical fitness in the city of Myanmar. Some excellent demonstrations with spinner size, yoga, Zumba. We're having such a great time. The city of Myanmar, I want to say thank you so much for a city showing that they're putting their, their citizens first because this gives people an opportunity and it will continue to grow and we'll continue to get the word out. But healing and health is one of the best things that can be done. And a healthy city means a happy city. So thank you, Myanmar. And just to bring an awareness to the community of how important it is for you to take your power back. And we do that by being healthy and positive individuals. Yoga demographic is everyone. Um, anyone that can walk, talk, you can be in a wheelchair, uh, you don't even have to talk. It's uh, any human being that's on this planet. There's no specific demographic for yoga. You can be a senior citizen, you can be a child, you can be recovering from an injury. Yoga is designed for every single body type, every socioeconomic, every color, every shape, every size. What it does for you is it works you in three ways. It works you mentally because it helps your mind to get stronger, to be more focused, to have more clarity. It works you physically to strengthen and continue to regenerate and rejuvenate the muscles and the tissues in the body. So there's no limitation. And it also works you spiritually. And when I say spiritually, yoga is not a religion, but it's a philosophy. It teaches you how to honor yourself and how to honor your brothers and sisters. It's great that we have these types of events in our city, that we can bring our children together with their parents to talk about their health and how they can best move forward with it in a healthy environment, in a healthy city. There's a lot of activity here today and we hope that we can do these more of these types of activities in the future in partnership with our sponsors. I have a spinner size class, which is spinning with a twist. It's kind of like Zumba on a bike. Um, and I took part in the health fair, and I, we had a great time. It's great cardio. It's really good for your heart. It's good for your lungs. Overall, it's, it's really good for blood pressure, bringing your blood pressure down, stabilizing your blood pressure. It's a cardio exercise. It's something you can do every day. So the overall health benefits is it's heart, it's lungs, um, and it's, it's great cardio. I want to thank the city of Miramar for inviting me out. We had a lovely time. I hope you enjoyed the demonstration. <laughs> Um, we have a great showcase of different trainers and instructors from all around Miramar, all local for our community to come to classes and attend. 
So it's um, it's a great organization, and we're uh, we're really happy to be here. You know, no matter what you do, just make sure you get out and get up and do something. Move your body, have fun. If Zumba's your thing, if spinning is your thing, it doesn't matter what it is, as long as you're up and moving and out. And grab your kids and get them to join you. I'd like to thank the city of Miramar to have this for the community, and um, it's a great thing to do for all of the people to see what's available for the community of Miramar. Hello, hello, hello. Good afternoon, good morning, everybody. We're here at the uh, Miramar Civic Center Plaza. Uh, I'm DJ Stan from XL Productions, making your event a breathing experience. Not only is Miramar an excellent place to raise a family, to attend A-rated schools, but the other important component is living a healthy lifestyle. Because I believe that a healthier you makes a healthier Miramar. And we have some excellent facilities here with our Parks and Recs Department. We have excellent opportunities for our kids and adults to get involved in athletic and physical fitness opportunities here in the city of Miramar.